It's a social media post many of you have been sharing. The post talks about residents in one Beauregard neighborhood angry they weren't allowed to help protect their homes. KPLC's Haley Jefferson shares both sides. Well, this area felt abandoned. And I can see where they feel that way. Community members of Beauregard Parish are left frustrated as they say state troopers interfered with their efforts in trying to contain the wildfire on Graybow Road. So our goal was to protect the community right north of us, which is three brand new builds and the homes over here. And by doing that, that's when the containment happened. And, you know, one is too many, uh, but we prevented many of others. Carrie Thibodeau and Pee Wee Murrow were on the front lines as they assisted in containing the spread of the wildfire. We got here, we got here probably 1.30 uh, early Sunday morning. And when I got here, it was nothing but a bunch of Beauregard Band of Brothers. And that's what it boiled down to. Uh, Local fire departments have already been pulled out. Uh, did have to go through a couple roadblocks. But they say during their efforts, along with other community members, were stopped when state troopers told citizens who brought their own tools to leave. Sergeant James Anderson says safety of the community was the priority. Louisiana state troopers and other law enforcement officers were out there assisting the, the various fire departments who were fighting that fire. Uh, the fire became immensely dangerous. It was uh, what we were told is crowning. Uh, we were asked to get people out of there. Uh, so we did. We instructed people to leave. Uh, there were people there that were interfering with operations. Uh, they were bringing in heavy equipment that was blocking the, the firefighters apparatus. Uh, and it became a very dangerous situation and they needed to leave okay. for their safety. Anderson says no arrests were made. We appreciate the concerns of the people of this community. We have troopers that are part of this community as well. We don't want anyone's property to be hurt, but by the same token, lives take precedence over property. So when the firefighters ask us to help evacuate that area, we're gonna assist them any way we can. In DeRitter, Haley Jefferson, 7 News.